I guess we're we're looking continually to um, you know to build some depth in, in positions. Um, Sean has been involved in the first three games he started in Italy, and um, in a specialist position like hooker, probably only nine and maybe ten as well, where you, you don't get guys playing other positions. You, know, you get props that sometimes switch sides. You get locks that can play both sides or in the back row. So we're just looking to continually build some depth and 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 uh, find out a little bit more about players um, that um, that we need to work with towards uh, what's coming up um, over the next couple of weeks and and towards the end of the year. We know a lot about Sean. Um, you know, he's been in camp for a long time. He's been in the squad a long time. He's got a lot of caps, and um, it's an opportunity for us to to see a bit more of other players. Um, so you know. That, that doesn't exclude him from next week, and it certainly doesn't exclude him for, from us going forward. It's it's about in a spe specialist position like hooker. Um, you know, if you lose a couple of players, then you know you you're obviously can't just you, you can't supplement that with a, a player who's maybe playing in the back row, like players six or seven or eight and six. You know, you need a specialist player, and we need to build and keep building that depth and knowledge of those players in that position. There's lots of things that we could improve on. Uh, you know, there's lots of things that we can uh, we can get better at. But that's continually the case. Last year, we didn't think we'd, you know, we were um, faultless in in any display. I, th I don't think you can ever uh, finish a game and feel like that was the the perfect game. There's always things that you're continually trying to improve on. When you get to a certain position, sides are also looking for maybe an in and an access point into your game and and uh, we've got to stay one step ahead of them uh, so you know we're continually looking to to improve build the foundations keep building those constants in our game but but also build some depth and some and some uh, some things that um, we can stay one step ahead of the opposition when they're trying to to uh, to knock us off um, we're, we're making a few errors, you know. We we you know, we we we're making errors. Um, <laughs> yeah, we're we're uh, we're losing a line out, and and you know, we're giving opposition the opportunity to play a little bit. Uh, you know, we're we're finding ourselves, um, you know, in, in good positions, but maybe we're getting turned over. You know, there's there's lots of things that that happen in a game that last year. We weren't perfect uh, by any means, you know, but we managed to to strike uh, from uh, Jacob's try against the All Blacks. You know that was, you know, a, a couple of really good moments. The ball won the play. You know, Kieran Reid's on the floor on the on the sideline. He's not up in the defensive line, and then we go. You know, so when you when you look at it, actually, there's lots of things that could stop us scoring that try, and that's the difference. Uh, you know, and, and similarly, there's things that have happened. This last three games that have maybe not happened last year uh, where we've been stopped in certain situations where last year we might have carried on and, and got the opportunity to, 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 to do what you're saying.